Hi there, Leo. It's Milady, and I'm here to bring you your May 2022 reading. How are you? Welcome back. So happy to have you back. So right in front of us, we have your reading for May 2022. So let's go ahead and talk about what's going on here. So this top row here, uh, this is your um, your current situation. This here is your obstacle. This is your advice card. As these cards here are your clarifying cards. So this uh, row here would be your what you can change. This here would be um, what you can't change. And then this right here would be what you may not be aware of. So let's go ahead and jump into this reading for you. So what we have here, Leo. Um, so in this first here, we're talking about um, uh, the current situation. So the current situation here, it's talking about, um, uh, well, first word, I mean, uh, I have to point out to uh, spirit of in intuitive, okay? The magician. So the magician um, stands here. It's letting us know of our skills, um, our current situation, it's related to beginning of romance, work-related, or other types of undertakings. Um, it also uh, talks about, uh, with this um, uh, this uh, Five of Cups, it talks about um, watch, okay? It's telling us to watch our surroundings as well as um, uh, talks about justified suspicion, okay? Um, it talks about guarding our, uh, guarding ourselves and our actions. Okay. It also points out to, uh, cleaning or cleansing and improvements, um, are needed here. Um, elimination of small problems is needed here. Okay. Uh, that's your current situation in the obstacle Leo. Um, it's obviously talking about, uh, love here. All right, so with this Ace of Cups, the obstacle is this love at first sight for you. All right, so Leo uh, fell in love, at, uh, love at first sight. It's a decision that you'd have to make, Leo. It's an important decision at that that needs to be made regarding love. Okay, now let's talk about uh, some things that are here clarifying here for you. So with this, um, with these cards here, grieving, freedom, and manifestation uh this is the these are uh what you can change so what is uh telling us here leo is that we'd have to uh visit um a uh let's say a counselor that's gonna help you through grieving okay um it talks about a deceased loved one uh a loved one that is trying to communicate with you um, it's telling you here to trust your intuition um, and it'll um, and it's telling you also that it will take you uh, um, and where it takes you it's if it feels right to go with it is what it's telling you okay now Leo it also points out to being careful for what you wish for and focus only on a positive outcome okay now for the what you can't change, you have empowerment here. And what does that mean, Leo, here? It talks about someone who is trying to control you. And it's time to stand up to get your opinion across. Okay? And then for the what you must, uh, what you may not uh, be aware of here is that you're being guided. All right? With the psychic ability, uh, Leo, this is all you. All right, your so your intuition is correct, and this is your path. Okay, so it's not, you know, uh, you know, it's not. I, I want to say like it's not you know, all in your head in the sense that you know, <laughs> you may be thinking like, oh, I'm crazy. Oh no, I'm thinking this. This is all wrong. No, you you're on point. You're right. It's your intuition that's guiding you and it's leading you to these decisions that would need to be made. And these are some important decisions at that. All right. And what's going to help you here is this here. All right. And what does this tell you here, uh, Leo? It points out to communication. All right. It points out to the... Um, um, let me see how I want to put this. I want you to read it. Um, yeah. It points out to the... 
Let's see here. What it talks about mainly, Leo, it's uh, uh, where you're being invited to use this energy of Mercury, okay, for communication, for talking and connecting with friends, for all forms of travel, for mani uh, manifesting um, uh, results in uh, the material world and for bringing different elements of life together. So it points out to basically, you know, the, um, the things that come with thought and to communicate to, to communication, including writing, teaching, speaking, learning, and studying. Okay. And I mean, it, it's really going to help you in this, in this sense here and what you're looking to do here and resolving this situation here. All right. That has to do with love clearly. All right. Cleansing is needed here. So, you know, uh, spiritual, spiritual cleansing is, uh, suggest or recommend it here um you know visit a grieving counselor you know to help you through certain things and um and get through it all right and this is what i have for you leo bye bye now